It has been just about one year since I purchased a 200 watt portable solar panel from Renogy. It's been up and down in terms of weather out here. The capacity or the performance of the solar panels have been great. I mean, I have no complaints other than my, I mentioned my battery was an issue. I get cheap batteries. I buy the um, lead acid deep cycle from the cheapest source. They have an automotive place here in town. And then they have a another uh, outfit that carries the uh, what do they call them? Interstate batteries. And they ha usually have sales and batteries going for anywhere between maybe $120, $150 for a good, uh, a good lead acid deep cycle battery. But the more I read up about them, the less interested I am in using that type of battery anymore. I want to branch off into buying a lithium iron phosphate battery if I can. The, my, I'm trying to justify it, the cost of five or six hundred bucks for a battery by noting that I, this is my third uh, lead acid battery deep cycle in the last four years. And I'm, I'm saying that I'm close to the six hundred dollar range for having bought batteries for my solar panel uh, array here. It's in a way, it's probably a better deal to get the lithium iron phosphate or whatever they're calling them systems because they last, one fellow was telling me they're projected to last over six years, some cases 10, some of them have a five or six year warranty through Renogy. So that's something that I'm considering. I'm enjoying the, my sense of security and and a reliable power out here in the desert with my Renogy 200 watt solar panels one year into it thank you that the sound out there the generator going I use that for my microwave oven that I've got and to operate some other things, battery chargers, and uh, some hair clippers, which I just got through using in my bathroom. I got unmentionables in there, but uh, solar panels great for the battery system in the trailer, but I do require a generator for heavy duty stuff for power. Most of the time it's just me hanging around out here so I don't have two people to deal with. I'm pretty easy going in terms of my power usage. Water, little bit of electricity, DC power for charging the computer and uh, small things I have, the cell phone. Uh, but the Renogy 200 watt system really does service all my needs like i was saying earlier the only thing i could use is a better battery for the long cold nights and times when that battery yield the amount of power available from the battery is substantially less with these lead acid batteries as opposed to the lithium iron phosphate, which I've read about and I've had a lot of people tell me that you get a lot more battery usage out of the lithium iron phosphate. You can uh, do much more when the sun's down after you, when you're just running on battery power. So that's something that I'm considering and overall enjoyment of my time out here. I'm, uh, I love my desert landscape where I'm staying at out in the La Posa North and a little while ways on 95 south of Quartzsite, the town. But I like it out here. Thank you.